Hi there Virgo, I'm Jennifer Angel, these are your sales for March. Now your month ahead, there is a full moon on the 8th in your sign. So you can expect to feel a little or maybe a lot off balance around this time. Full moon energy can provide the catalyst for change though, so that's what's good about it. And what this means for you Virgo, it's a good time to focus on you and give yourself some well needed and probably well overdue nurturing, okay? Some pampering is, is in the stars. Now for career and money, what you need to do now is set the foundations for what is to come. Get organized and get overdue jobs up to date. Within a few months, you are not going to have the time to do anything else but focus on your highest level of priority. So now is the time to attend to business. In regard to finances, be aware that budgeting and saving is high on your list right now as well. Money can come from unexpected sources and just when you need it the most. So it seems like you're in tune and you know due for a little, little uh, monetary surprise there. So that's good news. Now let's have a look at love and romance. The full moon in your sign affects your total life, including your personal life. And as such, things could get a little rocky, but one way or another, this energy does help you to sort out your feelings. If you are in a relationship, it will highlight the good and bad so you can deal with it. If you are single, it will spark your thoughts to provide clarity about your current and future relationships and what way you want to head for the future. Now your lucky numbers are 3, 7, 8 and 28. Your defining day, March the 8th. Right now you can learn to let go of the past to make room for the future Virgo, so very positive. Can be confronting, but very positive. I'm Jennifer Angel, thanks for watching.